gif. It's like an I infamous do. thing yes, I do. of Myron holding shield, yep. Leo charging forward smash, and hitting the shield, and it just it shield poked him. He yeah. swears he didn't drop it. No, I remember. I remember that very, very well. I think it was Smash Conference, actually. So here we go, final destination. I like striking to this stage. I think too many people take Ike to PS2, and that is a grave mistake. I agree. Because of the platforms, he could just chain nares on you so hard. Regard hey, this man is chaining them anyway. He does not care. Oh, oh no! no. Uh, Watch yourself. Myron flies right into the forward smash, and that puts you on notice for the rest of the Oh, season. absolutely. Watch your jump. Watch your shield. Yeah, watch watch your buttons. Watch everything. Yep. Because that hide your, is hide your kids. <laughs> like do what you gotta do. It's nasty. Oh my goodness, man. But Myron fighting back. 99% right now on Leo, and he has the purple on deck. That's next up. Gives it away. Wants to throw the yellow. If he can get maybe one or two more hits, and then get that grab with the blue. He should be able to get a kill. True. Oh, good jump. Good jump. Yeah. That was okay. the exact jump he needed, because if he didn't, he would have gotten hit by the True. purple down yep, smash. Yep, bear. Uh, not going to kill here. Went for an air dodge to get it closer. Going to be able to recover. Yeah, that's it. Can't do that to Olimar. Nope, not at all. Throws away the blue. Wants the yellow and the purple. Has the white also. Now, I'm kind of interested why he would want the yellow. Um, obviously, the yellow having the electric effect. Arcs Extended hitbox as well. Yeah, it, it arcs a little bit higher when you throw it, but it doesn't matter anyway because it has now perished thanks to that back air. Yeah. Yeah, I think always uh, they will, they'll look for that electric effect that's nice. Uh, kind of holds them down there too. Extended hitbox is always great, especially uh, if you're trying to look for uh, any kind of edge guard. Love the setups. I feel like I see this combo a lot too. Double purples and a white. The white to rack up damage and the purples just to beef it. A good forward air there. Yeah, Leo with, always uh, comes correct. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Leo with firm control right now in this first game. 100% on Myron, gonna have to recover with no Pikmin. He's doing okay. Yeah, he's, he's a nice dash attack. Yeah, he's gonna whistle that one, but nonetheless, that's gonna get him some damage. Ooh, jumps over the quick draw. Yep, that's safe. And he hesitated on that. I'm really surprised to hit his shield. I feel like he could have uh, got the up smash, but Myron paying a lot of respect to Leo there. There we go, back here will do it. And this Ike has been tearing through the competition, man. Yeah. He swears that Ike isn't his best character. Oh either. well, I mean, we all we all know what happened at Glitch, man. <laughs> I remember <laughs> you. <laughs> yep. It's I'm, like Salem, dude. There yeah. are so many players that are like, oh, that's like my tenth best character. Yep. So here we go. I was Next I game. was actually talking to uh, uh to meme about this, and I said, look, man, I feel like people have characters and they're great. But when you are playing a character majority of the time in tournament, that that's that's where you're getting that experience from, okay, right? Yeah, yeah. These characters that you were dominating people in friendlies or you're against top level players, even though they may be great, they still need to go through the, the fire and brimstone of a tournament before sure. they're refined. And I just feel like that's where people are at right now. They maybe have these really great characters where they feel like they do so in terms of friendlies, but again, tournament is a whole different beast. It's hard to know. Like, right now, the uh, the sneak tip, I'm going to give you guys a little bit of knowledge. Right now, Salem is apparently a secret Bayonetta main still. Yeah. Still using the character very strongly. And a lot of people say he's, you know, the best and super good, but he's never going to use it in tournament. Not just yet, anyway. He said he's going to use it in top eight to win this tournament. And that's apparently what he told Dang. Tameem, and Tameem was like, that's not real life. Well, he's going to have a long way because he lost in winners. Yep. Good up wow. from Leo. Yeah, while we were talking about that, Leo just yeah. dominating that first I know. Time. Myron might just join him soon enough, man. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> the way Leo is playing, he, just, he is not allowing anyone to be safe. You can see these aerials coming out. There's that setup again. Purple, purple, white. See a lot from Myron. Has the purple Pikmin on him, and he's oh, going to get so catch. much damage there. Yeah, racking up damage slowly but surely. So this is a, actually a great selection right here for Myron in terms of stage. Of course, uh, having these, uh, these platforms are really, really good for Olimar to kind of be underneath and really a uh, pressure. They kind of cover uh, entrance uh, at that 45 degree angle, which is really his kind of a uh, blind spot. Yeah. However, if Ike jumps in there, best believe you're getting comboed and best believe you're gonna die. And that's what we're seeing from Leia right now. And that's kind of the scary part of this selection. Yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking, is that you're giving Ike a lot more opportunities to hit you with Nair and chase you because of the platform. 
Uh, I do understand why Olimar would want to go here, just because you want to keep yourself under them. Yeah. But Ike, if he gets in there like he's been doing. But then again, I feel like all of his kills have been off on the side, dude. He keeps getting that back air over right. and over. Exactly. But that's, I think that's the main thing, because a lot of times people will pick stages because like, oh, this is good for me. You also have to look at what is good for your opponent. Yeah. Ooh, goes oh for the get-up attack, and just Leo is vicious. Jesus. Relentless. Of course. Oh, he doesn't go for the back air. I thought he was... Gone. Yeah, he oh, you know, he'll get there. it. Don't worry. It's coming. God, what a nasty move that Nair is. Good God. Yo, hitbox.com. That's what that is. <laughs> <laughs> Inzy Myron looking at the stage. list like, where the hell do I take this guy? Yep. This is... Platforms, what no. Do do? FD, no. What, what do you do? What the heck? What do you Town do? and City. Now, I kind of like this. The first time he was like, all right, no platforms. Second time he's like, okay, platforms. This time he's like, okay, no platforms and platforms. Yeah. You, you get both. Yeah. I mean, look, man. You, <laughs> I feel like ultimately when he needs to pick a stage where he can – Stay away from those platforms. Yeah. I feel like at this point, he needs to recognize, yeah, they're good for me, but Leo's using them better. Yes. And that you have sometimes you have to relinquish that. Yep. You have to kind of concede, like, yeah. okay, I can't play on my favorite or best stage because my I'm getting slapped up. Right. Can be tough. It can. So here we go, town and city on this next one. I want to see how Leo utilizes these platforms. And how Myron kind of sits under them. Good back air, just yep. following Myron at all times. Okay, head catch. Not really gonna get much here. Good fair. Jeez, doing a lot better in terms of sitting back, just sort of weathering the storm that yep. Leo puts on. True. Feels like a slower paced match thus far, which suits Myron well, but he's still gonna eat that nair into the back air. Good purple. Oh yeah, just in nick of time, man. The easy up air, gonna hit him out, and again, another juggle situation into the ledge trap. Not gonna get the F tilt, but the dare, man. I am loving these dares. I don't think I've ever seen Olimar spot dodge. Yeah. Like, I, I, like I, you, they usually just hold shield, but he does a little flip, it's cute. Yeah. Good down smash there. Myron looking a lot more comfortable in this game three. Oh gosh. Of course. <laughs> but the stage is huge. He's gonna survive. Good down tilt. tilt. Yep. Still and living. Myron, wow, just swings at him. Let's it go. Okay, Myron definitely in a better position this time around, but we know how these things snowball, man, at these early percents. Let's see what we can do. Goes for back throw. Trying to snipe him with Monique, not gonna be able, and of course that quick draw. Such a beautiful move. He has the blue out, so you know he wants to grab, but Leo not giving it to him. Ooh, Good down I love air. that swing. Definitely necessary. Goes for the double nair and just going for back. Oh my god! Using the platform! We called it! You gotta stop I'm picking this stuff! I'm telling you, man, what is life? This man runs these platforms. You can't give it to him. You can't let him have you any platform. Three games on Final Destination. That's all you can yeah. do against this guy. What's, your, what's yours is mine. That's what he's saying or right now. Or go to Kalos and just like never go to the oh, yeah. Like That's all you can do. Yeah. Myron just getting picked apart in this game. Absolutely. Oh, okay. Another up air. And wow, this is looking like it's going to be over in just a moment, man. This man is swinging. This is oh, yeah, why not? Oh, not why not? Three stop. The hero of Radiant Dawn is here. He NK Leo moves on. Swins that Ragnar right further on in the tournament. That was a round of 64, so Myron going to drop down the loser's bracket. Not out just yet. Leo going to keep advancing like we knew he he would. I, I mean, just, guys, third seed. I know, man, but I feel like it's the way that he's doing it. Yeah. Just looks dis especially with Ike, it just looks disrespectful. It doesn't, <laughs> like, it doesn't look right. Yeah, yeah. it's just like it's, this man is just swinging on gods, monkeys, demons. Like, who cares? Well, because it looks so easy. Yeah. Like, like the way he's playing, it's like, I could do that, but yeah. you can't. But I can't do that.
<laughs> the character just looks so like straightforward and easy. Yeah. But that's only with Leo. Like we've mm -hmm. seen Leo and we've seen uh, Mars. Yes. But really, no other Ikes. I mean, like Ryuga, obviously very talented, but we haven't seen him play to this level. You, you know, know which what I mean? is very interesting because I remember when he was talking about Ike and Ryuga was like, "Oh, well, this character, I'm gonna blow people up." But we haven't really seen him on the big stage, right? Well, he hasn't traveled much. Of and course, I think that's too. part of it. He's super talented. Oh, player, he's very talented. I am. I wish he was here. Yes. Yeah. I wish he was here because I do believe he is someone that's actually going to run the ranks. I mean, he is obviously, like you said, a very talented player. Yep. Um, and he is an Ike specialist. So I really want to see what he's going to be able to do. But, man, good stuff. Leo just in dominant fashion per use. He's nasty, dude. He